Upgrading. By the end of this training, you'll be able to upgrade the deployment agent, run a CPU's upgrade, and upgrade from smart console. CPUs is an advanced and intuitive mechanism for software deployment on Gaia OS, which supports deployment of single hotfixes, of a jumbo hotfixes, or a major version. CPUs is smart. It discovers only the applicable software updates, reboot only if required, auto authentication with download center, view hierarchy of software updates, email notification for new updates. It is fast, fast download, fast installation, and short downtime. CPUs is safe. Upgrade to next major version is performed on a new disk partition and preserves Gaia OS configuration, automatic conflicts validation, checksum validation of packages on target machine, self-test after installation, and auto rollback on failures. Another option is to update with CDT, which manage a deployment of software packages from your management server to the multiple managed security gateways and cluster members at the same time. So it's gonna be really simple. You're gonna right click on one of your gateways or even a cluster. You'll be able to either do a, a hotfix or a jumbo hotfix or even a version upgrade. And in case of a cluster, it will automatically update your cluster without any timeout, without any connection loss. It's going to be smooth and fluent. In order to do this lab, you will need smart console access, your organizational needs, a valid license, and internet access. For the purpose of this demo, I'm using an older Gaia machine just so I can go ahead and get some updates. I'm going to scroll all the way down to status and actions. I'm going to start off by manually updating the deployment agents. I can simply go ahead and check for updates, wait for a few minutes and the deployment agent will be updated automatically, or I can do it manually. Click on install deployment agent, browse, and simply select this deployment agent. Here we go, the deployment agent is now up to date and now the gateway is going to connect to the user center and we'll check if there are any new available packages. If there are any updates, I can just download them from the user center, which is what we call an online CPUs because we download a package from the cloud. However, if you already have that update file, you can go ahead and select import package and then perform what we call an offline CPUs. Okay, so it took a while, but now I can finally see the available downloads. So I can see that there's an update for smart console and there's a jumbo hotfix for already, already 110, which is take 66. So all I need to do is to unlock the configuration and I can go ahead and simply download this file from the internet. Alternatively, I can go ahead and do import package. And if I have it offline, I can just import it right now. This is what we call an offline CPUs. And if you would like to do this from smart console, you can just go ahead to your smart console. This is this is a different environment, so I also have a B gateway right here. And I can see that for a gateway, there's a jumbo hotfix. I can go ahead, right click, action, install hotfix. And here we go, it identified the file, and now I could just go ahead and click install. So you can either install the updates from CPUs or from Smart Console, which uses CDT, and that is implemented in the product. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.